So once you have a decent fit, you would uh, potentially like to uh, forecast this. Um, and uh, the forecast part of uh, what's impossible start uh, from the end of history. Uh, and then it will be controlled on uh, bottom of pressure schedule. Uh, in this case, it automatically picks the simulated uh, bottom of pressure at the last uh, day, which is uh, this number right uh, here. Uh, and then you can essentially run this for as many days as you like. This is 10 years total. Uh, you can also change it versus time uh, and, uh, as much as you uh, as much as you uh, like. And you can also increase this uh, part uh, as uh, well to let's say 10,000 days for for uh, for fun. Uh, and if I go in and run this model, it will not only run the historical time, but will also run the forecasted piece of, uh, of, uh, of the data. Um, and this is how you would then run the forecast of, uh, of uh, the model. And that forecast is something that you can import into your decline curve, uh, curve analysis.